Hey guys, what's up? PJ CrossFit Tiger. Uh, Christy here just asked how much weight we could have on one side of the bar before it tips. And, and I honestly, I didn't know. I was thinking maybe 245s. And of course, it would be different depending on whether you have a 15 pound bar, a 35 pound bar, or a 45 pound bar. A lighter bar is going to have less static inertia. Uh, this is a 35 pound bar. We have a 45, 25. We're going to start adding weight and see when it tips. So uh, let's check that out. Let's put that 15 on, Christy. <clears throat> Nothing yet. Uh, let's grab another 15. Okay. I'm going to hold it down so it doesn't tip. Uh, so it's you can actually see oh. it's starting to float a little bit. <laughs> so put like a 5 on it, or just a 10. Oh. Like that. Let's, let's grab a 5. We're going we're gonna to titrate. Oh my gosh. We're going to titrate to find the, find the exact weight. So let's see what happens here. Ooh, I'm scared. Try to float a little bit more. I, I'm not letting go yet. <laughs> let go. Get let ready. Go. Let go. I got I'm it. I'm nervous. Yeah, so you see it's starting to float up. Now it's tilting. So that's probably about the thresholds. We have a, wow, that's cool. Uh, we have 45, 25, uh, 215s. So what is that? 70, 100, 105 pounds on one side. Now, one thing to think about, of course, is that the, uh, the 25, 15, 15. They're a little bit wider for the same amount of weight. So 25, 15, 15, that's 55 pounds. If that was just a 45 pound plate and a 10, that would take up less space. So having the weight closer to the center of gravity would be less likely to tilt. So if it's two 45s, it might not be tipping just yet, uh, but maybe another 10 on top of that. Um, I think the end of the day is uh, whether it's a 45 or 35, we probably don't want to have more than a 45 pound difference on each side. So if we had a 45 on one side, 45 on the other, great. If we had two 45s, we probably want to make sure that we unload one of those before we take all the weight off one side. Um, with a 15 pound bar, we should never have 45 pounds on either side anyway because our max capacity is like 80 pounds. Um, but, so obviously don't, don't overload those. But uh, 45 pound bar, 35 pound bar, if you put more than two 45s on one side, oh it's God. gonna tilt. I've seen them fall on people's feet. Don't be that guy. <laughs>